Well, good evening wherever you are on this uh, most pleasant evening. There has been a clamour to get inside the ground tonight for a much-anticipated game. The uh, roads outside of the stadium have been bumper to bumper with traffic. The car parks are full. There is a torrent of humankind making its way from the nearby station. And we expect every seat to be filled. An atmosphere of uh, great expectation and excitement. One glance and you know where we are. It is one of the most recognisable arenas for the beautiful game in the world. And boy, does it add to the occasion. Southampton have gone with what looks like an orthodox 4-4-2, Jim. Reminders of a, a golden era in English football, I should add. And it continues to hold its place in the modern game. Playing a second striker runs the risk of being outnumbered in midfield, of course. So with the wider pairing and fullbacks, plenty of running has to be part of their play. And of course, the right service into the box. the way Konate positions himself well and cuts it out Thiago hoists it forward looks to play him in but, uh, a minor communications breakdown Thiago and it's Mane Driving on, he could shoot here. And that has sent him sprawling. You can get that clear. Jordan Henderson. Romeo can get it clear. Well, Red, he sorted that out. Here's Mohamed Salah, and he's cut it out. Could move up a gear here. Ward Prowse. Neither of the teams has yet taken the initiative. Ward Prowse tries to get it forward quickly. And for a moment, you felt that was going somewhere, but they'll have to go again. Oh, good interception. Knocked down by a lack of accuracy. It's come through. Southampton are playing with a pleasing width here, especially that front line. Is it working for you? Uh, it's not movement for the sake of it. Um, yes, it is working for me. There's a purpose to, to create space. Adams. With a delicate ball. Gets into some space, delivers a cross. Done very well to intervene. And no, that is pretty much the end of that. Diaz. Diaz looking to get on the end of this. Gets the better of his man. Oh, well defended. That he's had a shot. Breakthrough strike! Liverpool are really pouncing on any stray passes in midfield. We're talking seconds from interception to the back of the net. It's counter-attacking heaven.
Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. Well, that's the currency he deals in, and he's come good yet again. Never the one to let you down in these situations. Keeper's got good distance on that. Hardly anything between the sides, and it's 1-0. Played down the flank. Walker-Peters goes for a sweeping cross. Back out it comes. Mane. And now they can launch a counter. Questions were asked, but he's given the answers. And it's played forward. Adams unable to make it happen for all his good intentions. Chip through. Konate drives it forward. Gets away from his opponent. Can't get the better of his opposite number. He is not one readily to admit defeat. Don't be surprised if he tries that again. Mohamed Salah clips one through. Goes for goal! Ward Krause tries to clear. Henderson. Mohamed Salah. Real chance! Tries to get it clear. Walker-Peters passes it forward. Out to the right. Liverpool are leading with half-time drawing close. Armstrong drives it forward. Cleared without complication. And more than happy to take the muscular approach. Jordan Henderson, quick ball forward. Now it's Mohamed Salah. Nothing wrong with that tackle, ball won cleanly. Deftly done. And once more they can't get through. Receives it in a good position. Locked away. And there is the half time whistle. And there we are. Off they go for half time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half, but there has only been that one goal. It is very, very tight. What have we learned from the first 45 minutes? A lead that's fully justified for me. They've shown some excellent counter attacking now, so it's paying dividends. Liverpool happy to have the lead in a tight old game. Half time, 1 0. Well, the action has already resumed here. Liverpool carrying a one-goal lead. Jordan Henderson. Some excellent tackling here, and that one a perfect example. That's an untidy challenge, free kick given. Variety. It's come loose. Armstrong. Van Dyke. Konate. Konate goes looking. Alexander Arnold tries lifting it over. And that is as far as they're going to go. Adams. It's come through and he's had a quick look inside. Up to meet it! He will be living with himself. Cross 
midfield, changing the point of attack. Alexander Arnold looks to dig one in. Referee's given a throw. Lovely feet. Jordan Henderson. And it's Fabinho. Steered in. And that's been levered clear. Fabinho. Oh, some tackle that. Forward it goes. Thiago. Mane. Sergio, what are you thinking? Well, this lead is beginning to look a little delicate. I'd rather see them show the ambition and adventure to go further ahead. But it seems as if they've settled for a, a riskier approach now to defend this. Robertson. Mohamed Salah. It's Salah! A collective sigh of relief from the defence. for a change in personnel. Well, you have to feel a little for the player being taken off here. I think he's been made the scapegoat after that, but I guess something had to be done. I suppose it did need a little change. Henderson brings the ball forward. Liverpool get it back again. Now it's long. Breaks on here. And Dyke battles to win it back. Floats one over. He's through the middle. Bitnarek is there to heave it away. Mane. He's gone for it. He scores. And there the goal they've been looking for. Yeah, looking back at that, that's how you play on the counter. Quick and decisive and ruthless with the finish. I thought it was a stunning, stunning breakaway. Southampton making consecutive changes here. <laughs> Liverpool get themselves a two-goal cushion. Well, at 1-0, this contest was still nicely poised, but now that it's gone to two, mindsets are affected a lot more. Winning belief one way and that losing feeling the other. A heavy challenge. And it's Ward Prowse. Played out to the right. Armstrong provides an outlet. Looking to break out here. It's good progress he's made on the ball. Where to next? Diaz plays it forward. Diaz really just wasn't quick enough then. Well, his thinking certainly wasn't. Didn't make use of what I felt were some very good options. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Alexander Arnold tries to stroke it through. That was always going to be the keepers. And again, they run up against stubborn defending. And that's sprayed out wide. Just five minutes remaining now. Liverpool have turned to their bench, and we're going to have a substitution. Yeah, it's pretty obvious as to who was going to be taken off. His energy levels began to, to sag, and he was never going to last until the final whistle. 
Bednarek. Romeo goes looking. And here's Redmond. Some good play on the left-hand side now to profit from it. Fabinho gets it away. Well, needless to say, he was expecting a better ball than that. Full marks to him as he was just that bit quicker than everyone else on the follow-up. Southampton give themselves a chance of a fairy tale finish. Hoist it high. Got offside that time. off the ball there dinks one in nice little flick Very well played he saw that coming offside again And that will be the final act. Liverpool winners by the odd goal. It really could have gone either way, but a win is a win. Your reflections then, Jim? Yeah, we knew there was a sizeable gap in the quality of both squads and, and the story was told in predictable fashion. Many thanks to Jim, and with that, it is a very good night to you.